Yep, this is GSN Radio. You're with Bob Golan and Marianne Coran. Speaking of being proud. What? Uh, Mansbach just brought in. We were talking about this card a little oh, earlier that's that right. Jeremy designed. Yeah. And uh, Jeremy being his brand brand new first grader. Yeah. Just started first grade. How cute. Hey, uh, Johnny Man. Hey, guys. Tell us about this. Jer- what, what is the uh, deal Jeremy's here? artwork and this fabulous card. Well, first of all, I really appreciate you guys talking about that. I am beaming <laughs> completely about are. this. You are uh, a proud parent. Well, uh, Jeremy goes to a, a school that <clears throat> was involved with a, a program called Artwork for Education. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's from a company called Worldwise education, uh, wise not wide. Worldwise education, and uh, what they do is they're they're trying to, to raise money through programs to keep the arts alive in school. Yay! Basically, yeah, keep, boy. Uh, I know the things are are really dwindling down as far as arts, and a lot of people don't think that's important for development and imagination go, and growth though. for our little ones. Yeah, yeah. yeah um, but uh, th- this company is great about this. They go all over the world and they just uh, involve kids in programs where the kids actually draw um, greeting cards. They ask the kids from ages kindergarten through probably ninth grade yeah. uh, just to draw any kind of greeting card anything you want it could be birthday it could be Christmas um, these kind of things and so Jeremy participated last year in kindergarten uh, six years old and he got the idea to draw a, a dinosaur he picked a stegosaurus he's really into dinosaurs right That's that age right. sure sure <laughs> sure he knows everything about them yeah and so he wanted to draw a, dino- a dinosaur that had basically a birthday party going on uh, so he was drawing a stegosaurus with with a cake kind of with a cake with him and uh, his mother and I, we were we were sitting with him, and somebody gave a pun somewhere that it sounded right, a cakeosaurus yeah. instead of a stegosaurus. And so Jeremy's eyes just lit up. He instantly crumbled the page up he was doing, ah! started over, <laughs> and replaced all the spikes on the back of a stegosaurus with birthday cakes. Oh, so yes. it's this really cute clever. little dinosaur that has all these cakes on the back of him. He's smiling <laughs> ear to ear. He is. He's got a big smile. And he has toenails, too, which I like. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Keeps them clipped. <laughs> uh, it's but, really adorable. I used to make birthday cards when I was a kid and I never bought them. I always made homemade birthday cards. I think it's great that they encourage this stuff. Oh, it's yeah. so cool. I even have a 25th anniversary card that I made for my parents and I was 14 when I made that. So yeah. but I remembered, you know, just the excitement of giving somebody something homemade that you created and the sure. look on your parents' face when you would give them that. This is precious. And, and not only really... that, this thing this thing blew up bigger than we yeah, expected. Yeah, tell us about this whole program that's well, on, written on the back We got here. a call that that they love Jeremy's card, and and um, it was selected to be st- sold in stores at Whole Foods markets oh, uh, in packages just with the card itself, or a package of some other cards that other kids had created. Uh, and so we were really blown away. Then they called us again and said he's going to win an award oh, for no. this from from uh, Worldwide Education. And we thought, oh, okay, that's great. There's going to be 20, 30, 50 kids at the school that all are going to walk up and get this. Well, in front of 700 kids, wow. it was just him. We, we were just as shocked as he Whoa. was to get this award. They talked all about how big it was and how much money it's making for his school. And that oh, just blows us away. That is so cool. So, Can uh, I keep this one? Absolutely. Thank you. Absolutely. You should, you should let Jeremy sign it, actually. Oh, you, oh, oh yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. will you take it home and get it signed? <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, no, tell him he, we... Tell if, him we talked about it on the radio. What? If he if he signs it, she'll put it on eBay. Just right on eBay, yeah, and yeah, I'll probably buy don't, it. Don't say. Yeah, I'll right. probably bid on it. Right. But but yeah, that's that's pretty much it. So uh, so this this week they uh, they interview Jeremy. They're they interview Jeremy oh and, and put all the cameras around him. They want to put a, a blog out and I and a uh, podcast. Oh. So he's blowing up gosh. at six years old. We couldn't be more <laughs> proud. Well, I love it because you know it encouraging creativity, and I'm all for sports. We've got a jock at home. Sure. And it's it's going to save him from getting into trouble. You know, what I mean, it's just sure. it's just really great, especially for boys, as we know. But um, you know, the sports always gets first place in mm-hmm. the school yeah. funding, mm-hmm. and I know that it brings revenue to schools with games right. and things like that. But this is really important yeah. stuff. Darn right. And they're finding you know? ways like this to create revenue through the arts to keep it alive, keep it relevant, keep yeah. it important, yeah. so that we don't just forget and think that. You know, there's no way to make money off well, of these. Well, I was yes. good stuff. So. Very cool. Well, guys, Congratulations. Thank you, thank you so much. I want an autograph yeah. from Jeremy. And you guys, everybody out there, check out WorldWiseEducation.com. W-I-S-E, WorldWise. And that's where you can get the cards? That's where you can order the cards. There's right. an artwork for education section. And, <laughs> good uh, cause. Yeah, you Love guys. It. Thank you guys very, so much. Very, very cool.